It's right here between our ears. This is where it all starts. And this is why design and better enterprise models, better business plans, is what's going to save us. Design will save humanity from itself. And that's the agenda item right now. How do we save humanity from itself? So there is a proliferation of valuable jobs, and unfortunately, we don't pay our teachers what we pay our stockbrokers. Maybe we should just switch those salaries. That could be maybe a, a political campaign. Given, you know, given what teachers do, you know, my kids, my two daughters went through the public school system. My 19-year-old is going to get her BA next week. 19 BA started college at 15. Product of the public schools, but with parents who were involved, and that's the key thing: parental involvement. If you if you look at the statistics, the schools that have parental involvement, the kids tend to do better. So those of you who have kids, it's I know it's a commitment. Believe me, I had a lot of conflicts in my own life between the work we do, traveling around the world, all this kind of stuff, and the two kids. But those two kids are the ones that are going to take care of me when I'm old and feeble, which is right around the corner. So you've got a lot of curriculum development, actual teaching, administration. There's a lot of outdoor nature education going on. The schools in San Francisco, we have a program where we train the youth in doing uh, school gardens, planting trees, environmental service learning, getting them out of the classroom, doing team projects, teachers and students together, with some city funding and doing stuff that betters the community and makes everybody happy and knits the school into the surrounding neighborhood because we have this problem of this wall between a lot of our schools, colleges, and the surrounding community. Education is important because the youth of today are going to be running the world when the environmental shit hits the fan, if you'll pardon the express expression. And look at these numbers. Tiny reductions in use of resources 5% reduction in home energy use. That's like turn the light off when you leave the room, right? I go in offices of radical environmental groups, and you go in their conference room, and nobody's in there, and the light's on. And it's like, you people have PhDs, okay? And you haven't learned to turn the switch off? I, I put a sign over the light switch in our men's room. Don't leave this room until you turn out the light. You go in there, the light's on, and nobody's in the room. I was like, people, come on. You know how to read. We know you know how to read when you got hired wrote an application, you know. 5% reduction in gasoline use would save $7 billion a year. That's simple things like you really need to drive to the store five blocks away.